kids, thank you for watching uh, uh, Stories with a Lesson. So this story is a story about the Rebbe. Once upon a time, there was a... Um, this story actually happened to my grandmother. And to make a long story short... What happened was that when my grandparents came from Russia, they became the rabbi and the rabbison of a small shul. Now, this shul was called the Tzemach Tzedek Shul. And the reason it was called the Tzemach Tzedek Shul was because there were Hasidim disciples of the Tzemach Tzedek. They came to America and they started this shul, but their children already were not religious. So the president of the shul one day tells my grandfather that he wants to take down the Mechitza. And so my grandfather said, okay, I won't be the rabbi, and he left the shul. But my grandmother, Rebbe Sinshula, was quite a tough person. So she took a train to Rebbe, and she told the Rebbe what happened. So Rebbe said, why don't you have some of his friends speak to him? So she said, he's a very tough guy, he won't listen. So Rebbe says, why don't you have somebody maybe from the Federation to speak to him? So again, she said, he's very tough, he won't listen to anyone. So the Rebbe became very serious, and he put his head down for like five minutes, and she said that it looked like his face was on fire. And he lifted up his head and he said, If that's the case, then his father from heaven will have to come and tell him. And so, amazingly, this guy who was so tough, he wouldn't listen to anyone, two weeks later he came back to my grandfather, he says, we're putting back the mechitzah. And you know what? On his deathbed, 20 years later, he told my grandfather that he had a dream, and in his dream he felt his father was coming, and his father was choking him and telling him to put back the mechitzah. My grandfather said he had a lot of respect for his father. So it's a clear miracle. And this teaches us that even on earth, the Rebbe could go into heaven, and all the tzaddikim, all the souls, especially the Rebbe, they all are looking and hoping that we are going to do our best to bring Mashiach now.